Shushtar is an ancient city about 92 kilometers from Ahvaz, the center of the Khuzestan province. During the Sasanian era, it was an island city on the Karun River and selected to become the summer capital. Salausel Fortress is located on the hill overlooking Shatit River in the city of Shushtar. In pre-Islamic times, water from the river passed underneath the fortress and reached different parts of the city. The fortress was in use until the Ghajar period as a center for managing water supply from the river. Back in the old days, fortress was one of the main elements for the formation of a city. Salasel Fortress in Shushtar was one of them. The history of this fortress is not very clear for us, but we're sure that it played an important role in the political system of the Achaemenian Empire. It also did management of the watering system and canal that existed under this structure. Two canals have been excavated under Salosil Fortress, and after about 100 meters downstream, these canals merge and become the Doryun Open Canal. Further downstream, this canal once again divides into two branches. In addition to its role in controlling the water flow and its strategic military position, the fortress also housed the Khuzestan governor's office. Desful is one of the cities of Khuzestan province in southwestern Iran, which is located along the Dez River. According to the historian Hamdullah Mustafi, Desful is an Arabic name derived from the name Dejpol in Farsi, which consists of two words, Dej, fortress, and Pol, bridge. Khuzestan is the land of huge rivers. And of course, when you have rivers passing through cities, you need bridges to make transportation easy for people. Some of these bridges are a brand new architectural piece of art, and some others are a little bit old. By little bit, I mean 1,700, like this one. The Desful Bridge was constructed during the Sasanid era, and accounts were one of the ancient bridges in the world. At present, this bridge connects Desful and Andimeshk cities. The bridge currently has four large arches, and between every two of these is a smaller arch. Near the bridge, remnants of ancient mills can be observed. Water mills can be found in a limited number of areas in Iran, as the rotation of the wheels of this type of mill requires powerful and continuous hydropower. In the past, the water mills operated with the water power of the river and transfer of this power into the reservoirs. In this way, the river flow was accelerated, which caused the rotation of the mill wheels and the millstone and as a result, crushing the wheat. When I came to Desful, I was desperate to get some good food. So I looked for a hole in a wall, because that's where you find the best quality food with the cheapest price. This is another hole in the wall, but not for food. It's actually for after food, to go and relax. Des River and its flowing water not only rotates the mill wheels and crush the wheat, but also help the people of the city to enjoy some cool weather during the hot days of summer. I can see how people can relax for hours in these holes, or as they call them cats, and enjoy the beautiful sceneries of the Dez River. But people of Dez food are not really big fans of small and tiny places, because they used to live in beautiful traditional mansions. Desful has about 300 historical houses, and Tizno is one of them. As you can see, this house has all the elements of typical historical Persian house. This house belonged to a wealthy man, and it was built during the Ghajar era. The hot days of summer in the Khuzestan province, and specifically the city of Desful, can be annoying. But the heat cannot interrupt the lives of people of this region. The Sful Bazaar as the center of economy, social and cultural activities as alive and functioning even during the hottest days of summer. The hardworking people of Desful continue their businesses. Why they know there's always a river bank and its cats or holes to stop by at and chill out after a long day of work. Shahriyar Azimi for Iran.